The Museum of Russian Estate Culture of Galitan Estate is located at the territory of Kuzminsky Park. We are standing in the very center, the church square. This estate is over 300 years old. Its first owner, George the Loganov, used to be one of the richest people of his time and aid of Peter I. Later, his granddaughter married a representative of noble family of Galitan. It happened in the middle of the 17th century. Since that time, till 1917, this estate belonged to the Gallatin family. The Kuzminki estate was famous throughout the 18th century. Foreign delegations visited and annual mass celebrations were held in the Kuzminki estate. But for the owners, it was difficult to maintain the 200 hectares. The last owner of the estate was Prince Sergei Golitsyn, who served as privy councillor. Today, the Golitsyn family collectively manage it and have turned part of it into a museum. Hi, my name is Kya Sergei Michalovich Kolitin. I am the owner of this huge family estate. The first part of the day I always spend in my study and accept the reports from the estate manager. I sign documents and bills. My farmstead is rather big and includes a stable yard, poultry yard, greenhouses, orchard houses, Pawns extra, and as I see, three owners possess all that, the god, the Tsar, and me. Both the land and peasants belong to the nobility of the Tsar of Russia. Брат сестру качает, ее величает. Ой, люленьки, люли, ее величает. Ой, да. Without a son, no work is done. Дождик землю поливает, землю поливает, брат сестру качает. The tradition of keeping horses was passed on from nobles. Hybrid horses have always been displayed with pride. I do like horses, and this is one of my favorite horses. All love each other. Its name is Lakmush. Hey, where are you going?
Now it's dinner time. Dinner consists of a few dishes within a close family circle. While Ken asks Sergey Galitin, my brother is walking in his study. I'm checking if everything is in order in the dining room. Is everything ready for the dinner? Is the set of dishes there? Are the candlesticks and vases with fruit from our yards on the table? We have a pineapple stove house. We have fantastic apples, pears, peaches, apricots, lemons, and oranges. And all this should be served before the family sits at the table. When Empress Maria Fyodorovna used to be on a visit at Kuzminsky, Kenya Sergei Golichin invited me to the party. I was probably choosing a dress, gloves and a hat with a feather. Of course, I took my favorite black fan as you can talk to a man with his help. And you can also invite something for a date or even refuse with a fan. Alexandra Rosset was a maid of honor of the Russian Emperor's Palace and witnessed all the grand balls the royal family threw. This was the best place for recreation, intrigue, and politics. Those were real events in the circles of nobility. Рада вас видеть. В нашем усадебном доме 28 комнат. I'm very glad to see you. Our house has 28 living rooms. We play music here, listen to some literature pieces, read poems, and serve tea to the guests. Living rooms used to bring people together to discuss anything from politics to literature. Sometimes it was in living rooms where masterpieces were read for the first time. Nowadays, Russian families prefer walking in the Kuzminki with their children. The museum provides around 40 excursions and interactive programs for adults and children. Those interested can get acquainted with the representatives of the Golitsyn family. Those nobles here have always welcomed tourists. <laughs> 